Black women are three times more likely to die from pregnancy-related issues than white women. That's according to the CDC. Adam Orduna explains what health professionals are doing to change that. Black Maternal Health Week began seven years ago. The goal is to highlight and make sure that women of color feel empowered and educated while they are pregnant. CDC data shows the maternal mortality rate for black women was 70 deaths per 100,000 live births in 2021. It was very scary um, because, you know, I fit the narrative. The CDC also says there are many contributing factors, including underlying conditions and implicit bias. Rakaya Hayden is a mother of two. She says during her first pregnancy, she felt neglected by her doctor. Feeling dismissive, so I would say, hey, you know, I feel this way. And just like, oh, yeah, well, that's normal. Um, and continuously saying that, and then, like, it got to the point of where I felt like I was complaining. So when I did say something, it wasn't taken seriously. The head of the Wesley Birth Task Force is working to change that narrative. We will see you no yeah. matter what. We will take care of you no matter what. If this is your first appointment, we take care of you mm -hmm. where you are in your pregnancy. We definitely, we are concerned. We want to help. Um, we want to make a difference. Hayden says that women shouldn't feel alone and that they should stand up for themselves. It's more common than what people think. I mean, the data speaks for itself. Um, to not be afraid and to reach out to your community, your friends, because, you know, you just never know what they're dealing with. Um, and then find a solution for it. Hayden says more education about high-risk pregnancies is needed in the black communities. Wesley says that they meet with the black leadership to enhance education. Here for you, Adam Orduna, KSN News 3.